I got to say the one person so far, and maybe uh, she is becoming like a surrogate and we're going to see, or maybe it's a, uh, a leading indicator. But uh, the other day uh, we played a clip of where Jake Tapper basically said like, I've had enough with you, Katrina uh, Pearson. You have, um, that you, what you're saying is a complete lie. <laughs> and uh, I just got to say that what you're saying is a complete lie. Well, um, last night on Fox News, Megyn Kelly also seems to have lost her patience. Well, simply because he has said that he does not talk about that anymore. First thing is, Barack Obama is not on the ballot um, and no, not even Katrina, relevant no. to this election cycle. That's not no, gonna Megan, that no, this is, is going to fly, Megan, because this is completely not, irrelevant. The, the this is completely irrelevant to the election cycle. It's not completely irrelevant. Pause it for one second. People in this country. Uh, in pause it for one second. I want to remind you, this was last night. Less than 24 hours before Donald Trump held a major campaign event to announce that he thinks um, Barack Obama is uh, or concedes that Barack Obama was born in America. Last night, his spokesperson said completely irrelevant. Why are we even talking about this? not completely, completely irrelevant. irrelevant. You have a lot of people in this country, in particular African Americans, who feel that that position was a racist position meant to delegitimize the president. I'm taking no position on this. I'm relaying to you what they've said. And his own campaign manager came out and said he has shifted his belief on this. And now when asked directly, he refuses to confirm that. Why? And you also have a poll in South Carolina that shows that Mr. Trump is pushing on 30 percent African-American support. And Hillary Clinton has That's insulted half of the country. That's a dodge. This is not. Why no, it's not, Megan. I'm telling you, Mr. Trump has said he's not going to talk about it. I have given you the answer. He said yes. You want to know why? He that said is yet. Up to it's him. Like he's, there's like a tease baked into it. I just don't want to answer it yet. Robert, what do you think? The media is not going to force Mr. Trump to say anything he's not ready to say. The media didn't force him to come out and take a position being a birther, but he did. And then that came out because he wanted to be commander in chief. That came out of Hillary Clinton's campaign in 2008. That's already been established. Given the chance to question her about it, we certainly will. But right now we have you. Go ahead, Robert. Okay. All right. That's that's where that lie also comes from about Hillary Clinton. Hey, folks, Sam Cedar here. I just got back from a uh, company-wide meeting. Accounting is really coming down on me hard. We need to get to 100,000 subscribers as soon as possible. So uh, please, enjoy this uh, channel. Subscribe. Right up. Right up. Down. Right down there.